Hello. It is Monday, June 12, 15th. It is the 15th of June. Um, and I'm here with a quick update just on something I was doing yesterday and today because we have a couple of these Shure headphones and they're very nice and we use them for when we, you know, need to hear very precisely what's uh, been recorded. However, the bracket that actually attaches the headphone to the band uh, broke. Uh, broke twice, actually. It broke on both sides on mine. So, being that we work at the Geek Group, I rebuilt it uh, with 3D printed brackets to interface between the band and the actual earpiece. And I added some foam because these headphones actually hurt my head. They had inadequate padding before. So I've actually made it better. Um, doesn't fit my head as well as it did before, and it's not adjustable anymore, so anybody with a smaller head than mine is out of luck. But, you know, working headphones. Hey. It's a thing. Hi, AV Blog. It's Joe. You're here with Katie. And we're on the radio. And while this incredibly long song is playing that you can't hear uh, let's go through the, the radio setup so what we have is we got this Mac keyboard uh, so we have generally Joe will third person uh, because generally I sit in that red chair there but I'm not today currently because Will is helping with a thing and can't be running the board, and Katie is not running the board yet. Um, but yeah, so doing Joe Will guest, my computer, stereo, Will's computer, stereo, third computer, and then other stuff. We can have two more stereo tracks from computers. We're setting up a tape deck, uh, maybe a record player at some point. But yeah, just a standard little Mackie. It's nice, I like it. And then so we just have the, you know, two dual monitors, microphones. We only have the one uh, boom mic or boom stand deal. And uh, we don't have the mics that we would ideally have for broadcasting, but that's a thing that we'll get eventually. We got this set up today, two, which the brightness is super down on it, I don't know why, but we got this, this Orban Optimod TV8282 set up uh, to hopefully make the sound sound good. We got this screen here so we can tell what's on stream when we're on stream. Currently we're going out of that camera there. We have at my desk a video mixer down here so we can switch between the camera that's on right now that camera up there which really only shows me and this guy here courtesy of WZZM13 I could only assume uh, for getting right up close in Will's face uh, we have a Saturn console here under a whole bunch of junk because it doesn't do anything for us but eventually we'll be able to switch video, keep audio on us, and sort of narrate the day as it happens for the people on the stream. Which would be cool and fun, especially since neither Will nor I are very attractive. Of course the Wheatstone is over here, and eventually that'll get integrated into everything as well. Got our reel-to-reel -reel here. And, uh, yeah, so this is, this is what it is. Oh, I guess the other thing, uh, if you were listening to the birthday party stream, we played with it a little bit. We have this nice, uh, digital processor here, Digitech DSP128, uh, just for doing silly reverb sounds and stuff. Turns on, it works. It's great. 
uh, I want to play with that more and like actually know what is what. Uh, we were having some problems with the stream today, so I don't actually know if anybody's hearing anything, which is why all these nice people are up here. Trying to fix it. You and Katie's do. just trying not to be too nervous. You do, in fact, have video and audio. We got you out. You're live. Okay. So that's good. So that's good. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do my job, which is radio. Thanks for watching.